So why did you choose Homebush as a school? Well, to be honest, in the beginning, I didn't. I tried the selective test and I failed pretty miserably. I applied for a lot of other schools and they didn't take me in. I went for Homebush because I thought, you know what, just please accept me. And they did. They gave me a go when everyone else said, you're not good enough. And they said, we will give you our best if you give us yours. And that's the real reason that I'm here today. Well, the best memory in Homebush Boys High School that I have experienced by far up to year 12 is when one of my teachers, who I shall leave anonymous, decided to play a bit of music in one of my exams. I don't know why, but to this day, I can never forget it. Uh, I'd probably have to say during Duke of Ed, when we met a German couple who told us that their professions were engineering and accounting. And literally, 10 minutes later, one of the teachers was talking to us and giving us careers advice when he said that machines were taking over the world and that one of the worst possible jobs you could do was accounting. And the German couple, I remember, looked, us, looked straight at us and gave us the biggest dirties and we just didn't know what to do. We had a modern history exam and uh, uh, as soon as I sat down to uh, do the exam, um, I looked at the question and me and a bunch of other people, we burst into laughter because we knew we were um, probably not going to pass the exam. And my teacher scolded me. She said, uh, don't laugh, and then she started screaming at me, and um, I started laughing even harder. Well, I've seen a lot of things happen here. I've seen boys go from being maybe like 100 kilos when they enter year seven, like I was, to being the bunch of athletes that we all are now, obviously, after the trials. But more than that, I've also seen an entire school change. Like, I think we've all looked around at each other and we've seen each other grow and develop and become so much more than when we started here. And that's the real magic that I've seen at Homebush. Well, as a year 12 student, you know, I've uh, encountered various challenges, my friend. And uh, a lot of challenges, probably say, like, it was really hard to sort of um, go through like year 12 economics with like terrible <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna be serious right now, all right? Like, Vince didn't give us notes. And now my year 12's ruined. Uh, I'd probably have to say all the uh, copious amount of studying that I did for my trials and my previous two examination periods. And yeah. Well, to me, it's been a blast to be in Homebush Boys with all the teachers and the students. But at the end of the day, I believe just people, you know, friends. <sighs> I only have them. What am I going to miss the most? Uh, coming first in advanced English. I think at the end of the day, we can look at the school, we can look at a big fig tree, we can look at all the, all the corridors that we've walked down our entire lives, but the biggest thing that I'm going to miss is I'm going to miss the people. We've made a lot of connections here, a lot of friends, a lot of mates. We've all been tried and tested on all of the sports fields, the cricket fields, or even in the computer labs. And I'm going to miss seeing everyone who went through that journey with me go away. And that's what I'm going to miss most of all.
god! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> 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 the one the one I counted. Oh wow! Hey, how you doing, bro? <laughs>